In the roar of these floodwaters can be heard the sentence of death, not for a man, but for a village in Shropshire. It's a village which has known few visitors since disaster arrived. Beneath the track, the hillside is bursting with water. But for a lone car bearing our cameraman, it's a deserted road which every inch holds the threat of sudden subsidence. Beneath the road is clay, which has become overloaded with water and is now slipping down the hillside, together with the wreckage of many a Shropshire homestead. What we are looking on is a scene altogether too familiar in places where there are worked out pits. For about the cause of Jackfield's ordeal, there is no doubt. 300 feet above the village is a disused clay mine which has been flooded for the past 12 years. A whole village now suffers because none would suffer the expense of costly pumps. Jackfield's losses are heavy indeed, but the villagers believe it is not too late. If only the nearest shaft could be pumped out again, the landslide into the river might stop. Meanwhile, disaster moves on relentlessly at a speed of 12 inches every two days. A grim comment by nature on man's lack of foresight, but a comment which is almost outmatched by man's.